is days away from the next trial for an officer charged in connection with the arrest and death of Freddie Gray. Today, Officer Cesar Goodson Jr. chose to have his fate decided by a judge as opposed to a jury. Goodson faces the most serious charges, including second degree murder, manslaughter, and assault. WJZ investigator Mike Helgren is live at Courthouse East with more on today's decision and some analysis of that decision. Mike? Jessica, there have been several officers charged with crimes throughout the country who've chosen a bench trial as well, and we're joined by legal analyst Adam Ruther. Adam, what are the advantages here? So the advantage of a bench trial is that you're being tried by a professional finder of fact and someone who's very educated and experienced in the law. So in cases like this, where the defenses are very legalistic, they're about does the law apply to this set of facts? Sometimes it's advantageous to take a bench trial and put your fate in the hands of someone who's very well versed in exactly how the law works as opposed to a jury that may be more swayed by emotions. And Officer William Porter is expected to testify here. How crucial will his testimony be? Well, Officer Porter's testimony could go to one of the central issues in the case, which is what was in the mind of Officer Goodson in making the decision not to get medical attention for Freddie Gray, which obviously, whether that raises to the level of extreme disregard for human life is a central issue in this case. So Officer Porter's testimony could be pivotal. Thank you very much, Adam Ruther. And certainly, because this is a bench trial, it will move much faster. It all starts on Thursday. Back to you, Jessica. All right, Mike, thank you. And please stay with WJZ for complete coverage of Officer Goodson's trial. We'll bring you the very latest developments from the courtroom as the trial gets underway this week.